currently on the screen is the life of a tropical cyclone domicile. Apologies if I haven't got the pronunciation right. Uh, this uh, update on behalf of Nathan is being produced by myself, David, uh, via the uh, Force 13th Australia Oceana channel. And at the time of uh, doing this uh, recording, I'm currently under a severe thunderstorm warning and very intense uh, lightning and apology if uh, there's uh, thunder in the uh, background. Joy Typhoon a Warning Centre has just updated and the uh, tropical cyclone is located near 17 decibel 7 degrees south, 51 decibel 3 degrees east. Movement p past the 6 hours, uh, 200 degrees at 9 knots. Maximum sustained winds, 70 knots, gusting 85 knots. Uh, central pressure could be below 986. Uh, here's a look at some uh, tracks on uh, the uh, cyclone. Uh, wave height has increased to 24 feet. And it's located 282 nautical miles northwest of St. Dennis. And as mentioned, it's tracked south south west at 9 knots. And Matteo France, that they updated a couple of hours ago. Here's their current track chart. Sea surface temperature for the cyclone is uh, near 30 degrees Celsius. Uh, the Joint Typhoon Warning Centre in their latest advisory is uh, indicating that the cyclone will undergo rapid intensification. Uh, peaking at 100 knots uh, within 24 hours. Uh, correction, 110 knots within 36 hours and within 72 hours, uh, rapid weakening. Uh, here's a look at the radar and satellite imagery. Rapid weakening is expected due to strong westerly vertical wind shear, cool to sea surface temperatures. Now here's a look at the uh, Indian Ocean as a whole and precipitation. The rainfall scale is on the right hand side of the screen and it's the area in yellow. Now we have a look at some models on the region and the system. And Nathan will continue to bring updated information uh, on this uh, cyclone. And whilst the southern hemisphere is now nearing the peak of its uh, tropical cyclone season, over in the Fiji region, we have a tropical depression, uh, I think it's 09F, or, and uh, 90, Ves 97P. For uh, information, please monitor the AU channel. This is a GFS uh, model. We're looking at pressure and wind speed.
total precipitable water the scale was on the right hand side of the screen and you can definitely see the uh, tropical uh, cyclone in the uh, La Reunion area Now here's a couple of uh, models and their uh, tracks. This is the NCEP uh, GFS. The intensity scale are the uh, circles, and the different colours at the bottom right hand side of the screen. Sea surface temperature is the scale above it. The Navy's NAFGEM model. And the UK Met. So the three models are in uh, ag agreement when you look at the their tracks. Upper level divergence, and it's around 30 knots where the cyclone is located. wind shear twenty four hour shear tendency and you can definitely see the location uh, of the cyclone the uh, red icon tropical systems love the area in blue and green but it looks like uh, it's going to encounter increase of wind shear. The A50 millibar vorticity, this is one of my favourite uh, items. Tropical tidbits, uh, the plot on where the cyclone is located, and a couple of uh, tracks. And as mentioned, uh, Nathan will uh, continue to bring updated information on the uh, main channel and keep an eye on the uh, AU channel re uh, 97P, uh, which is on the Joint Typhoon Warnings Radar. You can follow Force 13's outlets, the website force13.com, which has had a revamp and is still under reconstruction, but take a look. Also, YouTube, of course, if you haven't subscribed, that might be a good idea. Visit Force 13. We're also on Facebook under the same name, of course, and you can like us on there, and you can also follow us on Twitter. Search Force 13 all in text for those. You can also add Force 13 on Skype or my personal account on Discord, Fool13, at extension 9094. And bye for now.